Good morning. Today is Tuesday, December 4th, the Tuesday of the uh, first week of Advent. I just wish to read the gospel passage for you this morning and then offer a brief reflection. This is a reading from the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Jesus rejoiced in the Holy Spirit and said, I give you praise, Father, Lord of heaven and earth, for although you have hidden these things from the wise and the learned, you have revealed them to the childlike. Yes, Father, such has been your gracious will. All things have been handed over to me by my Father. No one knows who the Son is except the Father, and who the Father is except the Son, and anyone whom the Son wishes to reveal him. Turning to the disciples in private, he said, Blessed are the eyes that see what you see. For I say to you, many prophets and kings desired to see what you see, but did not see it, and to hear what you hear, but did not hear it. The Gospel of the Lord. This Gospel passage comes from Luke 10, and uh, this passage brings to mind a couple of things. Uh, The first being, you know, the way that Jesus says that such has been your gracious will. And uh, the the Advent season is that preparation for God's plan, uh, basically saying, that what was long anticipated is finally coming true. And so, you know, the, the beautiful reality of what Jesus says, uh, and anyone to whom the Son wishes to reveal him. This is the reality of, of what Jesus does with his whole entire life, is he reveals who God the Father is. And, excuse me, um, one of the things that my one of my seminary professors uh, told us several times in, in class was that your job or your uh, your purpose in your priesthood will be to reveal or, or show rather the show the, the the tenderness of the Father's heart. This is a very important message, and what Jesus does uh, throughout his whole entire life, as I mentioned, he does that. He reveals it very beautifully, and he uh, shows forth uh, God the Father, who is mercy itself. And then the second part of the passage is, uh, that we uh, hear this morning or for, for Mass today, Blessed are the eyes that see what you see, for I say to you, many prophets and kings desired to see what you see, but did not see it. The reality uh, that what the apostles were able to see, hear, uh, and witness, uh, really kind of boils it up, uh, boils it down, I should say, uh, was remarkable. And so what Jesus you know, does in the, in the midst of them uh, he, he wants, you know, this is something that all, all people should long for. And so in the age of the church, uh, and, and where we find ourselves in 2018, how is Jesus revealed to me right now? Uh, hopefully uh, we can say, uh, obviously, in the sacraments, in what, in what the church offers uh, the believers, uh, and non-believers for that matter. Um, it's a matter of them uh, acquiescing or saying, yes, uh, I do believe which takes time, but also, you know, kind of, kind of that envy that we might have uh, of the apostles, of actually hearing what Jesus' voice sounded like, you know, the tone, uh, how strong it was. Um, so we, 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 we throw ourselves into the story, and we, we pray that, you know, as Jesus is revealed to us in the season of Advent, um, as Jesus reveals who God the Father is to us, uh, we ask for the Holy Spirit's guidance in all this, that we may uh, use this Advent season well, take advantage of it, not let it pass by, but uh, and mere, be mere uh, observers or uh, bystanders. But we, we throw ourselves into it. And uh, over the next uh, few days and weeks, I, I look forward to sharing more with you. Um, if you're viewing this on Facebook, there's really no way to just, uh, subscribe, but maybe share it, maybe share it with uh, uh, you know family or friends. Um, uh, if you're seeing this on YouTube, hit the subscribe button down below, and uh, I'll try to offer uh, the daily Mass readings in the description. And then also, if I uh, use any resources, I'll try and uh, cite those as well. But be assured my prayers for you this day of Advent, that God may bless you, that he may reveal his uh, face to you uh, most, uh, most beautifully, most perfectly, in our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. God bless.